This is the first video of a video series on electrical circuits. The first video I want to show you how to create a series circuit. The parts that you'll need to create a series circuit will be wire cutters, a spool of wire, a battery holder, and two D-sized batteries. Before the video I, I had taken a, um, a section of, or actually several sections of wire and I had cut them right off of the spool. And I also stripped the ends of the wire, exposing the metal portions of the wire to create three different wires. Okay. There are also three um, light bulb holders and three light bulbs, and there are two leads. There's a bottom lead, which is a um, serves as the negative lead, and this one here, it, the the upper one is the positive uh, lead of the battery holder. I'm sorry, of the um, light bulb holder. The first thing you're going to want to do is connect the first wire to the positive lead and you're going to bend it and twist it like that so it stays securely uh, together. The next one you're going to go from the positive down to the next one which is negative on the bottom and you're going to take use your fingers and you're going to twist it so it stays secured. Then you're going to take the next one, which is already connected. It's connected to the negative lead. So you're going to take it and connect it to the positive on the other light bulb holder. And twist it. And as you can see, these are all secured. You don't need the third um, wire. Um, and I'll show you why in a moment. I'm also going to bring these much closer together for you so you can observe and also keep these in the same direction so you can see them illuminated. I will take the D-sized battery and then place it into the battery holder and you'll hear it snap in. Um, on the battery holder they have a red wire and a black wire. The black one is the negative, the red one is the positive. You're going to want to check this. Um, light bulb and you're going to take the negative, the black one, and attach it to it and bend it. Okay, and now I'm going to take the red one and go to the other side of the circuit and touch it and they all should illuminate. Okay, as you notice there's uh, one that is not illuminated and there's a reason for that and I will explain that in the next video. As you can see that this is now a series circuit. Um, they are all in one line. If I were to break the circuit, okay, unattach one, or for example, uh, unscrew the light bulb, they will all go out. 